sure that you're not in the vessel. Mm -hmm. Okay? Then, put your finger up protecting the area. You want to just gently warm the patient. You want to feel some pressure and feel some discomfort as well. So we put in one cc right in that area. Okay. And again, you're going to move through the same opening. You're going to go medially about a centimeter down to get the supertrochlear. Again, you always want to aspirate. And then you're going to put one cc. Okay. So that's that one. You're going to go to the other side. You put your finger on the orbit to prevent the fluid from going downstream. So again, we're going to go to the notch, which is right there. We're going to get right in the, and then you want to aspirate to make sure you're not in the vessel. Finger over, and you want to put in one full cc. You doing okay? Yeah, I want to have a little more pressure. Perfect. You're doing great, okay? Yeah. So you're going to feel for the notch, which is right there. Okay. And again, you're going to go down, all the way down. You're going to aspirate. And you just want to inject right in that area. One cc. Okay. What's the definition of aspirate? Is when you pull back at all times, okay? Mm -hmm. So you don't worry, okay? There we go. You're doing great. So we're doing the transcutaneous approach, and I'm right in the fossa, so I'm gonna aspirate to make sure I'm not in a vessel, and in that direction, I'm gonna go ahead and with my finger right there to make sure. Perfect. And that's it. Excellent. All right. So I'm going to, while I'm here, we're going to do the mental nerve, the V3 branch. So the same idea. Mm -hmm. If you open your mouth, you see the central incisors, lateral incisors, her canine, and her first and second premolar. You put your finger in this direction. I already pre-marked where the nerve comes out. And you want to put the needle, and you want to go straight down in the midline. Mm -hmm. All the way. And you tell the patient, okay? So... You aspirate, and then just one cc is more than enough to block the nerve. Perfect. You want to do the same thing here. So central, lateral, first and second canine. Put your finger down, and you want to go straight down, right in this area. Aspirate, you want to block. Radical facial, so you feel here in the inferior aspect. You're going to go, it's very superficial, so you don't have to go deep at all. Always check to make sure you're not in a vessel by aspirating, and then you just inject slowly. Perfect. Good. Okay. And then you can close your mouth. Good. Now open it one more time. You feel for the artery. You'll feel like a pulse. You want to go underneath the artery. Okay. Always aspirate to make sure you're not in a vessel. And then you're going to inject one cc. And that blocks the auricular temporal nerve, okay? Very good. And you just have the patient turn around this way. And now I want to show you how to block the infraorbital and then the external nasal nerve. So the junction, the um, medial junction of the orbit, that's where you're going to find the infra, the, um, the inferior. There we go. You aspirate again, you run and boom. And then you're going to inject in that area. I'm going to do the same thing here. So you go all the way down. Aspirate. Perfect. And now for the external nasal, which supplies the nose. So this nerve supplies the, the, um, the bridge of the nose. Now the external nasal supplies the tip of the nose and all of this. So you want to block it again. You're going to go down. Aspirate to make sure you're not in the vessel. 
I'm gonna inject. Sound great? That's neat. Excellent. Mm -hmm. I know, because I'm running, you know. <laughs> so, all the way down. Aspirate. Okay, yeah. And you're gonna block. Okay, thank you so much. Perfect. And that, my friend, is that. So, we're done with the, the block, okay? The zygomatical facial. This is really nice because it blocks this entire area. Okay, open your jaw for me. Ah, very good. You feel and palpate for the artery and you go right in front of the artery and you go all the way in that space. Okay, you aspirate to make sure you're not in a vessel.